Hello handbaggers, this is the Military Mom coming to you from the Duck's Nest with two quick topics. The first would be the bag that I'm carrying today and the second is stuffing and storing of that bag. So allow me to introduce to you the bag that I'm carrying today. This is the Dooney & Burke Shiny It Satchel. And she has leather corner patches to protect her corners. She has leather straps with feet embedded. And she does have the D-rings for a crossbody or shoulder strap, but I never carry her that way because of the triangular shape of this bag. To me, it's easier to just carry her either in the crook of my arm or by her handle. So typically I do not carry uh, the same bag for weeks or months at a time. I change my bag out pretty much every day. Um, and as you can see, this bag will pick up any color. Um, she's just a very versatile bag. So I decided to carry her with the outfit I'm wearing today and uh, also, typically, I am not a big bag girl. I tend toward medium to small bags. However, during this time of year, I do carry a slightly larger bag because I carry things in my bag, such as hats and gloves. So, um, here, let me just show you really quickly how I styled this with the outerwear because it was 29 degrees here today with snow flurries. So I had to wear a little something, something. So here is my poncho. It's a gray and pink marled poncho along with my pink hat that I bought from Amazon. And I think it went very nicely with this bag. So, I am going to remove my hat, probably leave some fuzz in my teeny weeny afro. I don't even know if this is a teeny weeny afro. It's more of a weenie, a fade. Anyway, I've been wearing this hairstyle forever and it just works for my lifestyle. So, I'm going to unload my bag. There was my hat. Here is my Dooney and Burke It cosmetic pouch. My Dooney and Burke large zip around wallet. My keychain that is tethered. I have a keychain that probably belongs in the Smithsonian because it's so old and I've had it so long, but I hold on to it because it's leather. My glasses case that holds my sunglasses or my seeing glasses. I guess you can see with your sunglasses, so it would be either my sunglasses or my non-sunglasses. This is a leather pouch that I bought from a festival um, I keep my earbuds in it. And my checkbook. And my very sophisticated method for keeping my coupons. So now my bag is empty. And I stuff her with these air pillows. I have really been known to go into recycle bins to remove these and. Um, bring them home because I really like these to stuff my bags. Um, of course, I only bring home the ones that are clean and dry. So, I stuff my bag as full as possible to help my bags retain their shape. I empty them, I stuff them, I zip them, and I store them in
plastic bags. As I mentioned in my initial video, I do not store my bags in their dust covers because the dust covers are opaque and I could never figure out which bag was in which dust cover. You can also use um, dry cleaner bags to store your bags. I have quite a few bags in dry cleaner covers. So this is how she's stored. And I so envy you all who have those beautiful display cases. I don't have display cases. I use bookcases that I keep in my basement to store my bags, but I can very easily see all of my bags uh, that are stored this way. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And as always, happy carrying.